Minerva Teichert, I think, has really become a very familiar and beloved LDS artist. She was one of very few artists from the West who was able to study in the East. While she was there, one of her teachers, the very famous Robert Henry, asked her, has anyone painted that great Mormon story? And she said in her typical wit and I think spunk and sass, she responded, not to suit me. One of the unique and wonderful things about this series is that it was uncommissioned. No one asked her to do it. She very much felt compelled to do this. So in the day she was working, helping to raise her five children, working on the ranch, and in the evenings she would paint in her living room. For this series, she studied the Book of Mormon, she read, she would make notes. The exhibition flows chronologically through the Book of Mormon account, so it's almost as if you are reading the Book of Mormon as you go through. Minerva has humanized all the figures. They look like people that you might know that are going about their daily tasks, but are also trying to live very faithful lives. I think the whole message of the Book of Mormon, and particularly as Minerva has envisioned it here, is to remind us to think about where we are in relationship to the Savior, and that His arms are extended out to us no matter where we are and, and always. We chose the title of Visual Testimony for this exhibit because I think that it is really Minerva's beliefs put to paint. She said a couple of times, I did this because, because I believe it. And, and so I, I think these images hopefully will reinforce our commitment to read with new eyes, to renew our faith as well, and, and to think in more literal ways about the lives of the characters that we read about in the scriptures.